Hey everybody, Sidekick Guy here. Well, it's that time. Uh, the second Monday of every month, I review the finances from the previous month. So we're going to review the month of October. Uh, but before we get started, a warm welcome to all the new subscribers this month. Uh, we actually, when we did this last month, we were at about 300 subscribers and now we're well over 400 subscribers. So hi everybody that's uh, new to the channel and this is a very short update that just basically describes how much money we made last month and what our expenses were while we were doing our side gigs. So let's get to it. So our total income last month was $2,755. This is down a little bit from what it was last month, but it's still well within our budget. Uh, since we do have so many new subscribers, just real quick, how I like to do my side gigs is since I'm semi-retired, I only need to make about $1,900 a month to make the budget work between my income and my wife's income. So I just focus on making $100 a day and working about 19 days a month. So as long as I'm over $1,900, everything is good. So moving on with the rest of the numbers. Uh, we had 2,629 miles, and I added a new line to the report where I actually compute out for the whole month uh, my pay per mile uh, before gas. And you can see that on the right-hand side, uh, about halfway down, maybe a little bit more. It was a dollar and five cents per mile. Uh, and you can see the other numbers that are computed out, uh, how much gas we used. Gas was actually cost uh, much less this time around. It was only 6.9% of our total revenue. As long as it's under 10%, in my opinion, that's good for me. It makes the budget work. And my deposit to savings this month is $1,195. I put aside money for repairs to the car and for car replacement. That's what most of that money is. A small portion of it is also self-employment tax. You'll see the self-employment part called out uh, on the line that says FICA. When you're self-employed, 15.3% of your net income or your profit is taxed by the government for Medicare and for Social Security. So that's what I call my FICA line. It's 15.3% and I actually am going to start paying that in quarterly next year. Uh, now that I'm not working for the big uh, telecom company, I don't have them paying my FICA for me, so I'm going to have to worry about paying uh, Social Security and Medicare. We didn't work as many days uh, last month. We took a, a few days off uh, for vacation, and uh, except for the vacation though, we did pretty much work almost every day. And I've been saying this before in my videos, I really just enjoy these side gigs so much that uh, I don't, it doesn't bother me to work every day, but I felt like I needed a break, so it was nice to go down to Myrtle Beach and take a vacation. And so that's the wrap up. Uh, feel free to run it back and watch as many times as you want to get more information. If you want to download this spreadsheet that I use, uh, it's available. Just uh, look uh, in the about section of my channel and there's a link to where you can download and use this spreadsheet free of charge. I'm not going to charge it for just a simple spreadsheet with some formulas. And uh, I appreciate you watching the video. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a good day.